Hi everyone, my name is Emily Rothenberg and I am the program coordinator for the National Student Data Corps, a community developed initiative hosted by the Northeast Big Data Innovation Hub created to teach data science to learners around the world with a special focus on underserved institutions and communities. Today I'd like to provide some information regarding the NSDC's inaugural data science symposium a program for undergraduate and graduate students at private, public, and community colleges who are interested in data science to present their research and grow their data science knowledge and community. I will now take you through the NSDC DSS webpage to better inform you of how to participate. At the top, you will find some introductory information, and then you will notice two call for participation buttons. These buttons will link directly to two short Google Forms. Once you fill out the information in these forms, you instantly become a part of the NSDC DSS. We will then send you information regarding important dates, upcoming mentoring sessions, and more. So please feel free to use these buttons to apply for the roles you're interested in. Below, you will find a list of key dates to remember. Student submissions, which will include a one-page virtual poster board, a three to five minute audio or video presentation and a seven to 10 sentence abstract will be due by June 15th, 2022 at 11.59 p.m. Eastern time. Submissions will be grouped into two cohorts for judging, the undergraduate and community college student cohort and the graduate student cohort. The top three winners of each cohort will be announced by September, 2022 and they will then be invited to present their research at a live webinar in fall of 2022. All participants will receive certificates of participation and may have their work published on the NSDC website. Here is a step-by-step -step breakdown of how to participate in each of the three roles you may take in the symposium. A student participant or NSDC explorer may present research that has already been completed or may leverage the program's resources, including mentoring sessions and workshops, to assist them in completing their projects. To start, please fill out the call for participation form listed here. Then you can review the NSDC DSS theme challenges, which I will touch on in just a second, to start brainstorming a research topic of interest to you. Afterwards, you will be invited to upcoming mentoring sessions and workshops that the NSDC will be co-hosting. You will also see some reminders here of submission requirements and deadlines, including a link that will bring you to an example poster board to help you create yours. We are also inviting industry, nonprofit, and academic professionals, researchers, faculty members, and graduate students to apply to become an NSDC DSS mentor and or judge. Mentors will co-host virtual mentoring sessions with the NSDC HQ team for interested students through June of 2022. As for judges, the NSDC HQ team will invite you to a virtual evaluation portal once student participants upload their submission requirements. Between June 15th and July 30th, judges will use that provided evaluation portal to evaluate student submissions. Please express your interest for either of these roles using the call for participation form linked here and here. Paging down a bit further, you will find a list of themes and theme challenges or research ideas that you can use to create your own project. These drop downs are filled with creative prompts as well as informative data sets to help guide your project. We do, however, encourage you to research any approachable and appropriate topic that is of interest to you. Then we'll see a section on eligibility and resources. All undergraduate and graduate students from public, private, and community colleges may participate as NSDC explorers, while all graduate students, researchers, faculty members, industry, nonprofit, and academic professionals may participate as mentors and or judges. We've also listed some helpful resources to assist you in your roles. The NSDC Learner Central, which is packed with free resources from beginner level data science to computer science and programming, along with open data sets that you may use. The NSDC Video Library, which is composed of videos using the IBM Open Data Science for All GitHub content, SQL and R educational materials, and more. The NSDC Slack community, where you can find a DSS channel for all of your immediate questions and the opportunity to network recordings of past data science career panels, the theme challenges, the virtual mentoring sessions and workshops that you'll be invited to, 
a link to that example poster board again, and anything else that you may find. If you use any resources, please cite them on your poster board, in your presentation, and in your abstract. Evaluation criteria, submissions will be evaluated on the basis of their intellectual merit and broader, broader impact. Two criteria used by NSF to evaluate project proposals. Project submissions should demonstrate an understanding of the objectives and methods of data science research and make insights that contribute to greater societal goals. Paging down once more, you'll find a comprehensive list of FAQs to provide a bit more information on the program. If you have any unanswered questions, you can find the Stay Connected With Us section at the bottom of the page. Email the NSDC HQ team, join our Slack channel, follow us on social media, sign up for the NSDC mailing list, and check out some of our programs and upcoming events here. We truly look forward to having you join this supportive community, and we're so excited to see your projects come to life. Thanks for watching.